Hello, hi everyone. This is Sami here uh, from Agnami Solutions. Welcome to one more blog. Uh, this blog is all about, uh, as I've told you, like I'll be uh, putting uh, or making one more blog on the tank which we are going to of 300 by 150 on a depth uh, uh, of. Uh, we tried our best to make it. Uh, we tried our level best to make it uh, 30, 32, but on an average, it's coming to 25, 26. So this was the most complicated and challenging task what we had taken uh, from almost all uh, six, seven years we are into making the projects, the water tank projects. But this was the most uh, uh, challenging project for us because this was a very old tank of uh, 25, 30 years. Uh, so it was when we, when me and Viresh came and saw this, it was it was totally in a different uh, mess. Sita bate silti to, ille mission no, ille sakke bada kasta hai to. Alla marne ni thale kaise marne ko? Alla marne yaha the ek kano to mission se kaat kiye na, bada kaat mar kote jaye. Uh, he means like putting up all uh, the pieces of wooden logs. We have done the whole work. Uh, there was no proper structure of the tank here, but there was a very good water source. But when we came here, first project of Usama we did uh, nearby his house. The second project was this. So, like when we came here, see now you can see the. Uh, I'll zoom it up. Zoom it. See now you can see the machine. Machine no camera. Hold it. Zoom it. Hmm. You can see the machine there, uh, it's dipping off, it's dipping in the silk what we have over there. So like, we keep the wooden locks and we do it. So here you can see, bah, turn it up. Go go there, Rishi, there, can see there. Can see there, you can see there, you can see there. Bye. So here. So here you can see a hook that is covered. So you can see her. She is a zoom out there. And who is it? Oh, yes. He can do it. 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 Now, what is zooming out? You people can see what is zooming out. It's all a table finish, what we have done. To, to make a table finish tank and to make the work perfect, we should risk our machines to get in and get out. And lot of calculative risk we have to take. So now you can see this person also who went in, how delicately we have finished this water tank. It was most challenging task for us to give the shape. It was the most challenging task for us to give the shape for this tank. And the entire tank, now you can see, we have constructed a slope, we have constructed a road. This this road is of almost uh, uh, 30 feet, 25, is it? 25 feet right round road we have given. So, where are we going? Got to protect this side of uh, water, which which will uh, which will lead to come to the tanks and when there is a heavy rain, we will be giving a trunk at the side. So the trunk 
will be formed here at the side so that the water which comes in from the top should move in either either side or like we give a water to uh, the other side so it will not get in the time so the safety points what we have kept now as i have told you you can just see the table finish what we have given tell get a toss up the table finish of the work and the slope of the berm is almost 1 is to 1 what we have kept so here like going on you can just see the finish total finish kira to so This slide is one is to one what we have given, keeping uh, the safety measures so that like the slope what we have cut uh, the mud should not uh, get into the tank. which makes the tank uh, <coughs> which makes the tank strong what i mean to say is uh, when you have a heavy rain so like there are the chances where like uh, the mud can get because this is a challenging field and challenging project for us so that like we have to uh, take lot of precautions to get these things done work out see for example here see over there there are there is a loose soil so there is a water source coming there so the i mean mud is coming out so like tomorrow we will we'll make sure that like we put lot of mud and we keep the uh, slant right that is 1 is to 1 so coming back now have a look at it because another two days we are finishing the whole project here so you can see the uniformity you can see uh, the quality of work what we have done you can see what are the measurements uh, while constructing a tank we do you can see how risky the job is uh, to get uh, things done at the speedy level in the phase because once we take the project we should finish the project within given point of time otherwise uh, uh, the planters they get upset with the thing so we have lot of things to keep in mind so just i will so the entire road this is almost 25 feet uh, the road is coming so that like uh, if we the bike will move and the four wheel uh, tractors the four wheel pickups can move in get in the diesel get in the required uh, pumps and all that So over there, a ramp also. There, the ramp is coming. We are ready to construct it. Now you can see this machine very close by. How the silt was there? How we have removed? How we have cleaned? How we have constructed our tank? now coming back to the point <clears throat> what we have to understood uh, what what we have to understand is while taking the projects what we do is we analyze <coughs> what are the risk factors in it so when we came here the first point was there was a huge silt in it and it was a very old uh, tank which was uh, covered by silt of almost 15 uh, feet so like one one uh, Uh, biggest challenge was how to put the machines there then like we sat with a uh, person who was interested to get the tank done we told our uh, risk factors but they were not uh, uh, they didn't analyze the project will come so nice so like the project is coming very smooth and very nice if if our intents are right everything will fall into place so the next biggest challenge was uh, rains 
So if the rain comes, we can't complete the project at a given point of time. But we got rains also. Uh, only three days we got delayed in way doing it. The third point, what we have to see in is we make sure all the technicalities fit in, and there will be no damages in the coming henceforth uh, coming years to the time. And we 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 are technically sound getting things done. No one will take a risk of putting the machines underneath and get the silt washed. But we do it because we are here to survive. Survival is the fittest. So we have to take risks and we have to show our work. We have to show the quality work. Not only work, we have to show the quality work and then we have to move in forward. So these are the few things what I wanted to cover and show you. The next uh, uh, vlog will be uh, after uh, two days once we finish the project uh, these are the few things what I wanted to cover in this vlog and uh, show you people so the people who have not subscribed my channel please go and subscribe my channel I need your support I need your motivation to do the blogs to uh, improve myself and to give the knowledge what I am exactly doing so please subscribe the channel press the bell button uh, please if you, I mean, if you have liked the video, please go and uh, press the uh, button of uh, uh, like, like button, so that like I get motivated and do uh, a lot more videos. Agronomy solutions is all about. I have already, I have already, I always tell you in my blog, this agriculture is our culture. So like now, uh, I was just writing down a, uh, a note, so like I can say, our culture is agriculture. So this is a few things. Thanks for your. Uh, motivation support uh, please like my video please subscribe it uh, please share the video thank you one and all let's meet in the next vlog